With the U.S. presidential election just over two weeks away, Democrat Kamala Harris and her Republican rival Donald Trump spent the weekend trying to court early voters and shore up support in some of the most competitive states. Harris marked her 60th birthday on Sunday while campaigning in Georgia, outside of Atlanta. She spent the day visiting two churches, including a Baptist church in the city of Stonecrest. In remarks there, Harris delivered a message of unity, drawing a contrast between her vision for America and the divisive rhetoric of the current political climate, though she did not mention Trump by name. And what kind of country do we want to live in? A country of chaos, fear, and hate, or a country of freedom, compassion, and justice? Meanwhile, Trump on Sunday was at a McDonald's in suburban Philadelphia. My first day at McDonald's, I'm looking for a job. The former president cooked batches of french fries and handed out orders to supporters through the drive through window. Now I have worked at McDonald's. I've now worked for 15 minutes more than Kamala. Okay, she, she never worked here. Trump has said the McDonald's visit was intended in part as a jab at Harris, who says she worked at the fast food chain during her college years. Trump claims Harris never worked there, but he has provided no evidence to back that up. A Harris spokesperson said the stunt was a sign of Trump's desperation. When asked if he would accept the results of the 2024 election, Trump had this to say. Yeah, sure, if it's a fair election, always. I would always accept it if it's, if it's got to be a fair election. After a rally in Lancaster, Trump made his last Sunday Pennsylvania stop at a Pittsburgh Steelers game, where he pumped his fist to cheers from the crowd. Pennsylvania's Democratic Governor Josh Shapiro said Sunday on NBC's Meet the Press that the race in his state is tight. Georgia and Pennsylvania are two of the most competitive states in the country, with the latter standing out as the biggest prize on Election Day.